that car is insane. How to embarrass race car drivers bring a twin turbo F12. Good morning, you guys. Good morning, Damon Fire. How are you? What's up? How's Welcome everybody doing today? Back to the vlog. It's We're good going. to be back. We're Air going. Strike. How's it going? Better now. We're going Better to the now. track today, guys. And guess what? You don't know this, but Skinny over here was talking mad <laughs> your car saying that it's all bells and whistles, but his R8 will destroy you in a track time, and he wants to challenge you today. We're going to find out what's about to go down, but Skinny ain't so skinny, so it's going to slow down. You can faster than Damon at the track in your R8? No, I don't want to speak too much, because I don't let everybody down when I destroy him on the track. That makes no sense. You don't want to let him hit right? it. Sense, does it? That was really <laughs> confident. I got instantly nervous. He got instantly nervous. I feel nervous. like the F12 is going to embarrass He was worried everybody. everybody was going to judge him for what he was wearing today. <laughs> okay, so, hey, you said you liked my outfit when I came I here. do like your outfit. Yeah, man. So he's going to slip right. through the air. Guess what? It'd be David. Right. We're stealing this guy, and we're going to the track today. So get used to this face. <laughs> you didn't break his neck? Like, 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 snap. <laughs> Dude's thick. It's like an F1 driver with that neck. This dude works out. Do you work out? Just a little. That's not working out. That's, that's yeah, what you do with the clubs. Stuff. Let's load up. Ding. Load up the F12 and head to Auto Club Speedway and go meet up with our friend Dan from XCOM Tires. What in Sam? How are you doing right now, boy? I got a new club day for when you're not paying attention. Feature. You can only have one camshaft. Yep. My G Wagon has four. Four? <laughs> My car with one is still faster. No, it's not. The new G Wagon? The stock Viper? A hundred percent. I'd spank you. No, man, I might destroy you, my G Wagon. Oh, yeah, right, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. I got the whole yeah, enough cargo for a year's worth of MREs. <laughs> So these are new rod bearings for the uh, new main bearings. Oh, that's fun. That's good. I like people all your used and beat no, to hell. This is a, this is one of my old camshafts. I was at the motor shop. Yeah. But we found Holy the crap. new one we were putting in the car has actually damage on it, and the tolerance oh, no. the tolerance is not what I want. So we need to have a spare motor for Long Beach, right? So I had to make it up out of stuff I had. <laughs> I know what you're thinking. This is daily driven exotics. Why put in the car in a trailer? The issue with this car, it runs in a special 110 fuel. And if we drove it there, it would burn half a tank to get there. And drive back to half a tank. We don't have a big barrel of fuel with us. It was a special place to get it. But long story short, it goes in the trailer only because of the fuel burn. What mileage or anything like that. It really comes down to this logistics. But we'll figure it out. Is today our first track day ever? It is. You've never driven a car on track before? No, I haven't. Are you nervous? Uh, a little bit, not did really you though. Did you helmet with you? Yeah, I did. Did you actually bring a helmet? I did, I did. It's, uh, the helmet's actually special. It's the last helmet I wore before I got my motorcycle accident. Oh, so good I got, luck. I got, good to, luck. I got to redeem that helmet. It's a good omen, thank you. <laughs> right, you right? Oh, you've lost weight. No excuses. <laughs> That's why I didn't load cars before. <laughs> Seriously, that extra 30 pounds makes some of these window sills toit. Window sills loosen it so up. Small. Like, oh, this trailer's seen better days, but it really does suit its owner, who is also seeing better days. Every little mistake on here is kind of like a story of Dean's life. That was the first time he hit his head when he was a kid. That was his first time he drifted a car. And then everything after that is just part of the old patina. That's Dean Carnage Carney. I was sad to say the ranch hand hasn't seen much love. You need to take this thing and get it wrapped, probably sat in black, maybe some sort of livery on it. It does need wheels. It needs bigger tires too, because these tires are kind of embarrassing. Like the size of them, maybe bigger tires in this thing. You know what's embarrassing? Not having a wheel line. Oh yeah, there's that too, because Dean destroyed it. Look at this. Dean doesn't respect anything. He treats it like his trailer. I tried to reverse entry a dually and found out he can't. We do need to wrap this thing though. We need to wrap it, make it DD. I personally would wrap this the same as the race car. That would be cool. Because it'd give it some texture. We're allowed to take Jose, but we're not supposed to like- Diddle dally. Diddle dally dally. Like when we're done at the track, we're supposed to send Jose all the way back here and not go anywhere else. So the equipment here and a ball of Dom for good measure. Which how are we gonna run today? I'm driving a Ferrari. So gonna... Are you actually gonna wear that? My baller Ferrari helmet. That'll the man. Got team hats. It's cool, right? This is very cool. Dude, Hyper that's cool NFT. looking. The Hyper NFT logo on the hat like that with it raised. And then, oh, there's the best logo ever. And we're bringing the carnage. You guys killed it. Don't Better bring say, the carnage, please. How many did you make? We just uh, rebuilt your so far. That's not enough. Hold on. We're all gonna share the hat. Can we please get rid of the carnage? That's just asking for trouble. You just rebuilt that car. Look forward to see your sponsor logo. No. Oh, that looks good on you. That's a nice hat. Okay, we gotta go. I got better things to do than stare at your ugly <laughs> mug. The hat looks amazing. He did an amazing job. The gentleman knows oh, what he's you. doing. It's actually one of one, too. One of one. Just one of one, baby. Currently, the model the model situation's a bit depressing. I haven't worn a hat forward in. That's like, what looks this big? Yeah, look at this. Oh, 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 o
Yeah. yeah. Thanks, Thanks for doing that. Maybe for yeah. Yeah. Thanks. Oh, sure. Damn it. Maybe a shirt. Yeah. 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 <laughs> Alright guys, I know how much you like gas station challenges. How much will it cost to fill up the ranch hand? What do you think? What's your guess? Go. 200 bucks. 200. Alright, we're at $16. We're gonna be here for a minute. We need to top up the Huracan. It's down a quarter tank already. This is gonna be a nightmare. Because we have 65 miles to drive. We have two jugs of E85. This thing burns fuel faster than a 747 on takeoff. Lucky for us, there's a Chevron about a half mile away that has E85. We're gonna top it up so we don't have to use the race jugs. We brought a few race jugs full of E85, but all our cars now are legit like because race car. You can't almost go anywhere with, with them anymore. We have a handful that are daily drivers, but there's a handful that are not daily drivers anymore. Uh, I feel like you guys don't have a daily driven, driven reliable car anymore. They, <laughs> they're reliable. <laughs> yeah, well now. Hold on. Oh, he got on it. Oh, what'd you say, 200? 188.96. You lost the bet. I won the bet by paying the 188.96. Always get a receipt so you can do that right off. Woo, hot tamale. You're gonna wanna keep that one, right? Canada Revenue Agency, <laughs> right off. Right off. Right off, like Eric Who's this morning, right who off? just got out of bed. Yeah. Hey, <laughs> you didn't I'm even late. do your hair, you son of a bitch. Jose, do you like beef jerky? I do. I love this stuff. Like it's the best thing when you're rallying or you need a snack. Low in fat. You have to find the ones that are low in sugar or else you're gonna get I just get whatever. You just get whatever. <laughs> God, it must be nice to be young. How old are you again? Literally turned 37 today. Oh, you're only six years younger than me. Still in 30s though. Wait till you hit your 40s. <laughs> that sugar will matter when you're in your 40s. We're finally here, guys. Auto Club Speedway. This is a very large facility. Been here one time before. This is the very first place, if you guys remember. If you're OG, you'll remember this. This is where I drove the manual Murcielago with the blue camo wrap for the very first time. Right here. No insurance, no registration. It's pretty cool. Doing hot laps. Like Ricky Bobby. Shake and bake, baby. Shake and bake. Jose is already panicking because he can't find the key to the trailer. No way. Dead serious. I remember they were on here, but they're not on here. Jose, don't do this to me. Did Dean put you up to this? Ah, you got kidding me. <laughs> We got grinders, don't we? Jose, <laughs> hose B right now. <laughs> is this? Dan. Let's get out there, Dan. Man Dan, is this your new livery? Did you find it? Thank God. Oh my he God. couldn't find the keys to the trailer. <laughs> uh, so if you got all the way here and we're gonna get your car out? Dude, that would suck. I'm pissed. Uh, thank you for inviting us. Of course. So this is your track event? This is, no, this is, a, this? this is Apex. You, no, you said that you own this track and this is your track event? <laughs> this is my track, yes. Okay. This is my track. Can you tell you the same thing? Yeah. Dan's, da Dan's track, telling, yeah. t spreading rumors again or what? Yeah, it's my track, guys. I love it here. I so live here overnight. I have a little <laughs> calm down. I actually live in my GLA. This is Chris. What's, what's your track time so far? Right now, what I did? I think 10 I minutes. Wow. What's up, brother? What's going on, man? Is this your event? Yes. Well, thank you for having us. Us and uh, Fast Toys. Hell yeah. Thanks coming out. So what's this event all about? So we like to do a private track event just to go out, have fun, drive your cars. I want to see your Viper out here. Oh dude, that's a drift Viper. I don't think you guys allow drifting. No, we don't. See, that's I knew that. That's why I didn't bring it. But you got a twin turbo. That's why I didn't bring it. Yeah, I, brought, I brought a twin turbo F12 instead. Oh, that's perfect. Now if it gets, si if it gets sideways, it's not on purpose. Yeah. It just has 950 wheel horsepower. Well, you got to get you the wristband. Yeah. Wristbands and everything. Oh yeah, so. give me some. Give me Dan, some. Dan paid for everything, right? Give me some here. jewelry. Does it have a, do I get a blue wristband like this guy? <laughs> yes, you do. Oh, I do. <laughs> oh, <laughs> stop. Got to be baking. Dude. Yeah, model. Yeah, you're in all black. Yeah, and it's all quite black. warm out. Okay, yeah. we'll go get registered. We'll get all our gear. Right we'll back. get the car out. And you go set the world's slowest lap time. 10 minutes. How good is the Huracan? How great is it to have the twin turbo bath? There's a few issues. Running. There's a few issues to work out. Well, I stalled three times. So I'll be driving and slow traffic. I just shut off. So you figure that out. That's not good. And then it has an issue where, and I was warned about the Dawson clutch, where when you're stopped, you're going really slow. When you're in first gear, it'll rev up and it won't always grab, which is really dangerous trying to take like a turn, like a left turn, there's traffic coming. 
and you're revving it, revving it, revving it. So I think there's a few things to dial in. To, to dial in. Um, I don't know if that car is track ready, but I mean. We're about to find out. That's weird. Like, I don't know what that's all about, but like. They put an ankle bracelet on Dave. I need to home by 5 p.m. or something. It's going to be a serious issue for yeah. me. So 5 p.m. I need to be home. Yeah. Okay. I'm going back. Throw the tow hook inside the F12, and we got these transponders that'll take care of uh, tracking our lap times, because we're big on lap times here at Daily Driven Exotics. Got that, David? Well, this, this doesn't feel right. There it goes. Doesn't feel well, right. Well, first of all, I was like, that's cross threading. <laughs> so I just pushed harder. <laughs> I said, that's what we used to do back when I was a teenager when we were on cars. <laughs> just put it in harder. Yeah. I did my nitrous kit, my first nitrous kit. I stripped it. Really? Uh, the fitting glue in the bottle leaked all in my car. You're wondering why we're here right now. You're watching at home, sitting there on your big screen TV, you're lazy boy with a bowl of popcorn. You missed work today. That's your problem, not ours. Make your own money. We're here because we want to see what this car can do on the distress test. We can't do that on the street, obviously. So Mr. Farr holding the camera right now is going to take this out there. I'll be I'm going to take it out there. I'm holding the camera right now. I'm here to document the experience. On the track is like the most extreme abuse you can do to a car. You can never do this on a street. You get a red line all the time. Yeah, just beating the piss out of it. So Corners, left, right, left, right, left, right. You have a new suspension, obviously new alignment. Yeah. Not Let's familiar. hope they put it in, they tightened it up properly. Let's hope the bolts are tight on that. And yeah. it's also hope that the car doesn't overheat because it's a hot day right now. Correct. And you've had, you've complained about some heating issues to begin with. Correct. So we brought Hose B with us. Correct. So whatever breaks fucking fixing on the spot. That's why I was right. <laughs> I noticed you torqued the wheels of the truck before you left. Did yeah. you torque the wheels of the F12? Not yet. Okay, perfect. We'll so not yet, I mean, not yet's the best answer for I haven't done it. Yes. However, Dean Carney Carnage, calls himself that. You can't give yourself your own nickname, Dean did. Carnage, how original. Said you have to get back as soon as we're done here because he has work for you to do. So what we're gonna do is after we're done here, we're gonna go to Beverly Hills. We're gonna, some fun. We're gonna go for dinner and pasta and ice cream and maybe hit a Ferris wheel or something. You like Louis Vuitton? You like Louis Vuitton? Gucci? Yeah, because we really have all day based on what Dean said. The also, you have his credit card, right? Yeah. I yeah, we're going shopping, baby. Uh... We're going shopping! <laughs> I'm excited. This is the first time we can kind of take it out, stretch his legs, test the suspension. Yeah, dude, it's gonna be sick. Plus, also, I brought this. Damon's been this track. I've never been here before, so pretty cool to see what it looks like. Apparently, there's a professional race team here ripping around, so it's open passing, even in the corner, because I've never experienced that track before. First lap in the F12. It's gonna need a bigger radiator. It creeps up in the temps. It's not like it's overheating, but I'm keeping an eye on it. It's getting to about 110 Celsius. All right, Hose B, put a radiator in there, would you? 110. We brought it back in. We're gonna let it cool down. And then what we'll do is we'll kind of reset everything and we'll go for another lap. In your car today, hey. Track in the GLA, soccer mom Why edition. Why ride and scare me? I want to get some reactions. I want you to actually make me scared. Come on in. Where's your car? Out of the end, let's go get it. It's right there. Right, can you go out right now? We're going, right now. Okay, I'm gonna grab a GoPro. Okay. I'll ride with you. Done. And see if you can scare me. Let's do it. So I'm gonna go with Dan. He's never done a track day before. He's already nervous. See how close he gets to his back bumper. On the back of his car? Yeah, I'll be in there with the camera. Let's oh, see what he says. Dude, I'll give him a little, I'll give him a little kiss. A little it's kiss. called F12 Twin Turbo Embarrasses Non-Super Car Owner, which is Dan. <laughs> it can't be of a lesser car. Then you look like an ass. Babe. Fine, embarrass the R8 while you're out there. All right, all right, all right. Do you, think you, you can beat Damon's lap time? What was it? It doesn't even matter. You're just gonna beat him anyways? It's gonna get beat. You're cocky. Sometimes. Cocky R8 owner gets destroyed by Twin Turbo F12. <laughs> Let's go. All right, short shorts. We're yeah, good. Perfect for the track in case there's a fire. Yeah, because my hair has these uh, anti-flammable follicles on them, so we're good. Who's the cockier one of the two? Is it Skinny or Damon? Who's the cockier one? Yeah. Damon. Well, right now, Skinny's talking all type of is gonna beat Damon on the track. Skinny's never been on a racetrack. Neither have you. I have today. <laughs> He's already close to you. <laughs> All the way up your ass. There's your race car driver. There's the bank. Go, Dan! Dan Tyman! Very focused right now. Hard break, 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 hard break, hard break, hard break. Pitch it into the apex. The pipe bottle. Carry through. Fix apex. Cross the curve. Carry through, throttle, and a little bit of understeer, and we're off the track. Now we're back. 
back on the track now. He's doing well, ladies and gentlemen. This is his first time on the racetrack. Going to Cole. Grab it, grab it, grab it. Damn oh. sideways behind us. Black flag is like the worst flag you can get at the track. 100%. And like, in F1, that's a big deal. That's a bad, yeah, it's like you It's a bad day at the office in F1. Okay, so I bet you wonder why you got black flag. What do you do? Uh, I can hold my phone? Yep, it was you. You're not supposed phone? to have any sort of devices in your hand at any point while you're on track. How'd they oh, see so that? You keep it up, down? No, you're supposed to not have it at all. How do I, well, I always have my phone at the car. He made me, he told me, so I won't do it again. Oh, no, yeah, yeah. He you made have me. it right there, that's fine, but that one, I gotta, have, I gotta see you actually put it in the console or uh, inside the glove box. Okay. And that's Ready? What, that's okay, no more. Dan, no I'm more. not gonna film this, dude. No more. It's for his Instagram, man. It's really egotistical. <laughs> all right. See, you asked all the hood up. Where were you, Skinny? What's that? Where were you? I need it all to myself. <laughs> Dan got a black flag. I got a black flag. You got a black flag. You got a flag? A black one. You got kicked off the track. No. Yeah. Well, I know what he did. Wait till we get out of the car, I'll tell you. Okay, Dan got the black flag because he's going too fast on the racetrack. No. There's a speed limit. You snitched. What? You have to watch for the corner men. You're not allowed to have a camera. Like, legit, I can't go anywhere because of those tires. That car just slides everywhere. Not good. I good can't thing, even come out of a, a corner. I think it's Michelin's. We're all right. We're good. Yeah, they're not. They're it's not like no. excuses yeah. for us. Low time. Overheating. And uh, Bob was saying that we're not allowed to drift the track. I wasn't really drifting, it was power sliding. There's a difference. I wasn't trying to drift into the corner, I was power sliding out of the corner because the difference is this car has so much power and old tires that as soon as I try to accelerate, as soon as it hits 4,500 and then 5,000 and all the boost comes on and all the torque, it just blows the tires off. Like, dude, even in third gear, it was just like, Whoa! like smoke. All right, boys, closing time. Damon is currently being given birth to by a Ferrari. <laughs> <laughs> Get me out of here! Woo! She's tight. Oh, oh. Why is his shirt off right now? Oh, huh? Why is his shirt off? Is that a normal racing car thing? Does Dean do that ever? <laughs> I didn't bring my undershirt. I forgot it. And I wasn't about to wear my pristine white shirt, get it all sweaty and wrinkly, and then wear that for the rest of the day. So I took my shirt off. Is that okay with you? Dave gets, Go fight him. Hey, Go hey, fight him. Jose, Dave gets nervous when guys don't have their shirts on because it starts to get a little, starts to get a little hard. Confused. Confused. <laughs> Damon and his Eastern European tattoo collection. <laughs> what prison was that? When are you gonna get some tattoos? We gotta get Dave a sleeve. Not a koi fish though. Koi fish are good luck. I have no interest in any tattoos. Yeah, you do. I don't want a tattoo. The at this lower, point. the lower back, right above the butt. You said you wanted to get one. A target, them. yeah. A tramp. And I want a measuring stick. A measuring stick on my inner thigh. <laughs> well, that was. It was fun. It was hot. It's really hot. It's too bad the hurricane out, but has some problems. We want to break it, so we're gonna get that dialed in. The F12 was overheating. Yeah, we're gonna get that dialed in. It just gets too hot for it. It's a hot day. Well, I'll tell you one thing. You embarrassed that race team over there, dude. It was amazing. They're cool. They're cool guys. But I mean, the truth is, they were like, damn, that car is insane. Everybody was like, I can't believe you twin turboed an F12. And I was like, I can't believe we did either because it was a really bad idea. Back to the lab, as we call it. I'm not even called the DD shop, it's the DD lab. Guess what? what? The results are in. You beat Damon Fryer. That's what the f talking about, baby. Owe me lunch now. All that working out. I don't know if it's working. Hockey RA owner takes down F12 That's and the entire really, race team. It's a really good title on thumbnail. I'm just fucking you. Oh. You're like the slowest car out there today. Are you yeah. Plus the guys on the radio were like, the guy's not following the race line. I'm like, he's never done this before. Yeah. I was really pushed your bubble, didn't I? You ain't sh you ain't Walk away, just leave the car. You know what? Just leave the car. <laughs> That's the last time we ever saw Skinny and his world. You caught? Dude, I'm so hot. Yeah, it is. It's 98.6 degrees. Oh.
AC works though. Thank you 316. I was worried that I would have no AC, but you know I overheat. You know I'm sensitive. Should be like an ABL feeling count so I can talk about my childhood in here with me. That would have been nice. <laughs> Get the left side of the bumper, like get the time it right. <laughs> <laughs> I just hit the mirror again. Boys will be boys, no matter how old you are, you will always want to hit a comb with your car or truck. Dean's race program is like literally almost done. We have a whole separate vlog slash docuseries on that. So I haven't really been talking about it much, but it's been a lot of long days for those boys. Uh, Jose was pumped today, come for a ride with us and actually get out of the shop, but when we get back, he has to get his arms up inside that Dean, up inside that race car that Dean owns, and uh, get it done. We're skinny. I don't know. You never wait for him. I did wait for him. Hey, I know, bro. Dave never wants to wait. Yeah, so I'm, I'm sorry, man. Dave, Dave doesn't really think of anybody except for himself when he's on the road. You skinny? <laughs> All right, trailer might have a small issue. We know it's a bit of swing. Let's find out what's going on with the old trailer. Go to the show and lap. Yeah, I'm dirty. Dean trailer's in tip top shape, and I'd be shocked if anything would go wrong with it. Yeah, it uh, never has an issue. How much is a trailer worth to buy a new one in the same shape size? I don't know. I'm going to buy a trailer. Let's go buy a trailer. Let's go buy a right trailer. Now, let's go. Sakes. All right, let's go, guys. Go in your car. You, you want to drive the Huracan? Oh, it shoots car. real nice. Does it drive nice? On the front traffic, it's amazing. Turn radio on, rookie. I think I'm on the wrong channel. How the wrong channel? I tried turning it down. We got there like. Who just threw that at us? See that? That kind of threw that, and it went in like this. The wind, and the wind caught it, and it just missed you guys. Yeah, no, no. Someone said him and Fryer threw it. <laughs> so rude. And that's why they threw it. Damon, trailer man. Like of all the things that I have an issue with, a trailer's like the dumbest issue. It doesn't have an engine in it or a suspension. It has leaf springs that break. It has bearings that fail. It has electric brakes that fail. Oh, sketchy! Trying to get a trailer back on the freeway, and no one moves over, including this guy. Oh yeah! Oh yeah! 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 Just live your life. Oh, Mercedes. Okay, just to clarify, I'm talking a lot. Of Car. This is a 1400 wheel horsepower twin turbo Huracan capable of low eight second passes on a quarter mile. It's not built for what I'm doing right now, driving on the freeway. Yeah, I can do it, but it's not gonna be comfortable to stock Huracan. And I'm kind of a and I like being comfortable, which is why I own a Bentley and a Rolls Royce and whatever, whatever. 316 built an amazing car, and it's a drag car now. It's not a street car. Ah! What's happening in my garage? We got another toolbox. It's actually smaller than the toolbox. Hey guys. Hey guys, Jason's here. Yeah. Hope you don't buy my spot. Thank you to Protect the Film Solutions, mainly Jason, and maybe Ryan, for doing Dean's car so quickly and doing our bike. Uh, it not quick. It was 24 hours. It was, it was pretty fast. <laughs> it was 24 hours. <laughs> so if you guys need a 24 hour wrap, call Protect the Film <laughs> That was the one time, the last time we did that was your car three years ago. What do you got, Jason? Well, you guys have a bunch of things from your lawyer, but uh, <laughs> <laughs> I don't think you can show this. What is it? Is that mail? Some weight. Yeah. This is all from uh, oh my God. some tickets. Okay, that's fine. Just yeah. Get rid of that. Get rid of that. What's in here now? Oh, Jason's bringing the heat. Some sponsor logos. Hyper NFT coming in clutch. This is liquid gold right here. They sponsored us with decal. That's it. Yeah, that's <laughs> it. The only thing. You guys. Oh, you called it. You did say that. Dude, I was like, somebody's gonna stand up there when he said nobody's gonna stand up there. Don't bop it. Not like backflip. Don't backflip bop it. You guys are like, whoa. Are you a Formula Drift fan? Because it suggests so. What does this say? I don't know. What does it say, Dean? Formula Drift uh, Japan. <laughs> that Italian Japanese. Italian Japanese. Yeah. Right <laughs> yeah. There you go. Formula Drift with uh, front wheel drive. How's How you going? doing? Welcome back. Oh, what do you think of the shop? <laughs> it's pretty sweet. Oh, straight to the, straight to the camera. <laughs> right to the camera. What's up? You brought your vitamins with you, I see. There you go. <laughs> Drink it up now. Hey. That's pretty sweet. I can't show the audience. You know the best part about oh, yeah. is? You didn't have to put it together. <laughs> yeah, I didn't have to touch it. <laughs> Have you been? Yeah. Oh, Taking yeah. a holiday? You know? This is the race guy. We have a few days. She'll be in good shape. We're back here. Uh, yeah. We've got my work cut out for me. Yeah. We've been in worse situations, right? One last time? Uh, we've been in those situations. <laughs> That's for sure. We've had time, though. How's the fun? Been our side. That was good. Where'd you fly in from? From Dallas. Dallas. Where's your cowboy boots? <laughs> Oh, <laughs> no.
I'm sorry. <laughs> you didn't break the window though. <laughs> if I knocked the window off, I would've been upset. Who else from your crew is coming? Hey, you gotta meet the new truck driver. It's gonna be here in 30 minutes. Hi. He's from Canada. He is actually. Hang on, hang on, hang on. I'm practicing. Oh. Oh. <laughs> You're over here. How do you do the zoom? The mark so far. Not, not you, the other mark. This mark. This mark. This mark. Jesus Christ. Okay, okay, <laughs> What? Uh, you knocked over this. <laughs> you got him. You got him. <laughs> Friendly fire. <laughs> Friendly fire. Oh, Matt was all time on Pornhub. <laughs> 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 oh yeah? <laughs> 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 I'll tell you right now, I should never have power tools in my head. Or power. <laughs> <laughs> then Jason? I love how that's on right now. It's so loud. It's such a cheater's car. You can like that, slitter into your garage power. at night. Listen to all that power. Okay, Damon, bring in the S12 and let's chat about cooling for a minute. I am. Because she's yeah. hot. Yeah, she was too hot today. Really? Hot. She was way too hot. hot. Oh, Jason. <laughs> Such a <laughs> So disrespectful on our property. You got power. I thought you were leaving. I left a skin mark. <laughs> hey, you have to charge the trail right now. Do you actually? You do, yeah. It's pretty funny. Janky piece of he was joking, well, I thought he was joking when he taught me. He's like, no, you have to charge us, the lifts don't work inside or anything. I'm like, oh, great. Smell it. Smell of success. Oh, there's a cop right there, too. Oh, the fence, the There's fence, literally the fence, a cop right there. <laughs> Damon likes it hard, that's all. Damon likes it hard. So yeah, we had some major heat issues today at the track. Turn four and turn seven. Turn four and seven. I thought it was turn six and nine, you said <laughs> first. <laughs> <laughs> Tell me what happened today. Got to use my Ferrari helmet All right, today. Seb. Oh, cooling, what can we do? Yeah, two laps of the tell track me, and this thing me, was hot. Yeah, it could be two laps of Nürburgring. That's 13 miles each lap. They're short laps. <laughs> yeah, it was a short How lap. long? Let's say two minutes. After the end of the second lap. By the, by by the time I was pulling into the pits, it was like hitting the over temp. Ethanol would be a big fix here. Ethanol. Uh, so how do we do that? Additional we put a bigger read. Valve injectors above valve. Yeah. Um, obviously the radiator situation is like based around the straight car packaging, right? So <coughs> if we want to here, here. Yeah, kill it. Kill it. Okay. Put like all ECUs in the back? Yes. Get right to start making the harness. Do you want the car to be usable now or do you want to start actually making a race car now? Like because what I'm saying, usable now. I what think we use ceramic coat the headers right now okay. to contain the heat and push it actually out the exhaust. No, yeah. I'm not. The exhaust is right here. No, no, the heat's down here. But it's also radiating off the nah. exhaust already, right? So it's heat's helping the heads and stuff. So if we ceramic coat the headers inside now, it is going to lower temperature. I know, but that's where the exhaust comes out. <laughs> <laughs> Dean loves it when we start to like date. Start pretending like <laughs> we know something about any of this, but we don't. He's like, like that like gets hot, that gets hot, that gets hot, and hood's closed, and the hood heat stays over, and it spills over. You can see the heat spilling over. And uh, we'll go into uh, Jesus Christ, give me a break. Uh, double pass radiator first. Well, let's pause your race project till Sunday. Double pass radiator. No, not pausing the let's race. Pause program. that race because I can't start right now. We'll get it after it. After we'll skip the first race. We'll get this done. You know what my we'll solution was? We we're going to skip your salary this week. <laughs> <laughs> we do we do the same thing that we that they do to Dean's car. We take the radiator and put it in the back and put a Lexan window in with a vent in it. Are you gonna do that this car? And run and run oh, yeah, water absolutely. lines yeah. all the way yeah. around. But even at that, keep in mind this is a drift car that you can't show. It is only built for doing two laps back to back and then we brake and put tires on. You have to decide on what the fate of this car is. Well, is it gonna be furious. a drift car or is it gonna be a track? <laughs> Okay. You have to decide if it's a track car or a drift car. If it's a drift car, it's only made for doing two laps at a time. If it's a track car, it's a very different configuration. And if it's a track car, this needs to go away. Where it's nice and hidden and nicely done, so you're not having all this heat on top of the motor. 
it needs to be whatever I say it's going to be. But at the end of the yeah, day, but you have to add say YouTube what it's going to be. YouTube car at the end of it. Of course, but you have to say what it's going to be. Is it going to be a drift pack? Yeah, is a unicorn do more in two laps? No, no, not. the unicorn can run longer. I want, the, I want unicorn. Yeah, based on a set of tires. How long does the set of tires last? I How long does pizza strain? Categorically tell you they last for sixty seconds. Cubic dollars. <laughs> You hate telling us all. You hate telling us all these lines. So what are you gonna do? Put more rubber on tires? I want. I want. I want a Ferrari unicorn. That's what I want. Yeah. How much is gonna cost? So you want something that runs for sixty seconds on full tilt, and also on methanol, right? Okay. Let's do that. It's the coldest burn you can ever do. Let's do that. Yeah. I won't be around this car when it's wrong if you do it. But why? What methanol burns clear, and you can't actually see it when it's on fire. Oh. So you're just yeah. Let's get warm in here, boys. That would suck. Yeah, it does suck. Okay, what's the next best thing? I don't want to be on an invisible fire. Ethanol, like night. Ethanol. Yeah. Like your car. I'll run that car. So yeah. injectors, we're talking. 12 volt valve, yeah, because yeah. this is DI, um, and this open the injectors is not. Oh my god, this is getting painful. <laughs> <laughs> did, did he leave and come back and race the driver there? What happened? Yes. He's a big Hublot guy as well. Yes. Hublo. They sponsor Hublo. me. I can't keep them on my wrist because people keep robbing me for them. <laughs> Make your mind up on what you want. Unicorn style car or track car? I want the ethanol with the injectors and it'll last longer and it'll be colder. But it's only going to last as long as the set of tires will last, Damon. The set of tires only going to last fine. 60 seconds. I'm cool with tires. I have a tire sponsor. Who are they? Shout out to XCOMP. <laughs> Shout out to Nexon. <laughs> oh, you got me. You got me. Yeah, Paul, I'll send you an invoice. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so we have a plan. We have a plan. We're going to buy Microsoft shares. Hubble Pass. <laughs> Hubble Pass right now. I wasn't paying attention. I wasn't paying attention. No, no, you're sleeping over there. Regardless, if we make a factory replacement style to hobble pass AVR radiator, yeah. regardless, if we put it in here at the start and then we decide afterwards we put it in the rear, mm -hmm. we're able to use the same radiator back. Let's do it. So we can do that. Double pass radiator, ceramic coat the headers first. Oh, first. Yeah. Okay. And then I think, radiator, ceramic. And I think we go to Willow and we'll see if we can make it last 65 seconds. I would rather do this car like piecemeal in stages instead of opening up a can of worms. So and they after, can see it. yeah, exactly. Everyone gets to see it. And after four months and not listening to them very long, where's my car? 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 <laughs> this so is true. So it's much better for able to give you something every month, right? So you can go, hey, go try this aspect of it now, and then you break it and come back with it. Yes, I agree. I also like to take my sponsor today, Hugo. Hugo. Fine time pieces for fine gentlemen. VP power. power pretty much controls my life. Is this a Greek food restaurant? Happy wife, happy life. Would you say you spend <laughs> more? Would you say you spend more on fuel or mortgage payments? On uh, fuel now. Thanks to this. <laughs> Seriously, it's like three hundred and eighty dollars to fill this car. Speaking of V12s, we have another V12 over here in the corner yeah. that we haven't really heard yet. So I'm thinking in our next vlog, maybe we straight pipe it. We hear the V12. Can we straight pipe it, dude. Like we can cut it all, saws all at all. It's my favorite car in the shop at the moment. Even tomorrow, we'll cut off the exhaust. Let's cut off the exhaust. Oh, boys, what the? Yeah, what, dude, welcome to YouTube, right Dean. Do we not have this conversation. Happy medium. <laughs> cut it off. Cut <laughs> it <laughs> off. Cut <laughs> it <laughs> off. <laughs> cut <laughs> it <laughs> off. <laughs> straight pipe it. <laughs> If you let my boys alone, I need to do not disturb them until after 6 p.m. tomorrow night, yes. If you let them work until 6 p.m. with no distraction. Guys, next vlog, straight piping the 550. See you in the next one. Hey it doesn't happen, listen. Okay, uh, do you guys need fuel? Because our truck stop right now and your truckers. Yep, we're getting fuel. No, we don't. Get your fuel. What are you getting here? I saw because you guys need gas. Jose said I need gas. When did I say that? When you were for Hoonigan, were you also a liar there as well? <laughs> <laughs>